Hey, America, how you doing? I just realized something right now. I just went by the dunes of the Cape, and I thought I saw Alaska once, but that's what I was looking at. I got my hand up give, telling God, thank you. Now I remember where I saw that before. <laughs> it looks just like, fuck, oh, somebody's pulling up. Hey, how you doing? Oh, wonderful. Do you believe in God? But do you believe in God? That there is a God? Uh, there is a God. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. That's all you had to say. That's all you had to say. I'm not gifting you shit today. Do you know who Thomas Sowell is? I don't think so. That. That's why I'm not gifting you shit today. Wait, don't run. That's all right. Let them wait. S-O-W-E-L-L. -L. Go ahead. Go ahead. Anyway, I'm not gifting them a fucking thing. Maybe he gets the word. Democrat. Don't know Thomas Sowell. Stupid fuck. You got nothing and I like it. Ha 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 The soup guy. Soup Nazi. Stop with your Nazi bullshit too. We can use Nazi. We all know what Nazi means. You cocksuckers. You're the Nazis, you communist pricks. Trying to take over my country. You go fuck yourselves. You communist son of a bitches. There's so much more I gotta say. I think I said somewhere that if I got dot, 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 we're having conversations. I have to stop people all the time. So just give me a minute. Shut the fuck up. I'm not, that's not, we're not, I'm, I'm, I'm working on it. I'm a work in progress, so is he. <laughs> that's funny fucking thing right there. You think he's perfect? No. No. That's why I didn't want to know who he was. I want Samuel. He might be perfect when you see him. I'm sure as hell happy I got him the way he is. You ain't canceling Samuel L. You ain't canceling Tommy Chong. Although I think he's a liberal prick, but I still... What the fuck? He's God. <laughs> You're welcome, Tommy. And you ain't canceling Preach. Because that's how God laughs. I keep telling you. I think I said it somewhere. I can't send this video, but I know my wife just found out and her fat ass idiot of a retard husband actually did talk to God and that was her fucking response. Why does he always do these things? <laughs> Tell me that's not funny. That's what I need when I said the leash. I'm joking. I make fun of her all the time. I'm going to constantly, whether God's with me or not, I don't know how long this lasts. Maybe he goes away tomorrow. I don't give a fuck long he's with me now. That's all I care about. Anyway, what am I at? Three minutes. I'm getting a lot of shit in in three minutes. How am I doing? Better than before, I think. I hope people follow my progression. You got to start at the very bottom, work your way all the way up, and pay attention. Because even in the worst of the worst videos, there's a joke in there that you're going to hear later on. But I'm going to tell you, oh, yeah, that came from way back there. And you're going to miss it. That's how I do life. I just passed a joke to... I don't think they'll pass it on, but I passed it to five different fucking people. Tell this one to tell that one to tell this one to tell that one. They all, their heads fucking spun. <laughs> like the guy was in the world. Anyway, we're off to get our lobster. We're almost there. I keep wanting to turn. The GPS keeps telling me to go straight. I'm listening to voices. The bitch won't. I guess I got to go to the very end. And I think, uh, can someone tell my wife? I'm probably going to watch the sunset. Can she call my work? She knows all the numbers. I'm not calling them. It's a call number. She don't have to talk to nobody. They made it too easy. You know how many times they guilted me into work? I didn't want to fucking be there overtime. You know all that? Uh, don't kill yourself at work, man. It ain't worth it. You make your money. Do some overtime. Find a hobby. Find something when you retire. I tell everybody this. I've been saying this my whole life. The best thing I could do in life is retirement. When I had my kid, my wife kicked me out of the house after the second day. She couldn't take it. I now realize it's because I wouldn't shut up. <laughs> my golf game, I got it under 100. Dave was like, what the fuck got into you? I said, Dave, I've golfed every day for the last month. <laughs> Oh, I used sick time. Oh, it's okay. I was still... That's what a lot of us do, but... It's not like I didn't take care of the kid. My wife went back to work. Then I had the kid every fucking day, so... The one cancels out the other the way I see it. 
What do you think? If not, I got someone you can complain to. <laughs> oh, that's funny shit right there. Would you send me a dollar? Just one dollar. Actually, would you send Glenn Beck $20 so he can recoup the billion dollars plus that I've been spending for him? <laughs> it's a funny fucking joke, though, ain't it? This poor prick is in the gun to what hit him. I spent $3 billion because this fucking asshole wants to prove this God, and I only got $2 billion. This motherfucker better be on the level. <laughs> And I can't send this gold. Glenn, I love you, brother. Don't change a thing. Send me whatever you like and listen to my shit. And if you like it, give me a hey, dude. That was pretty good. All right? I don't care, man. Send me whatever the fuck you think. Hey, Tesla, I keep hearing about your electric car. I can't get a fucking anything electric to work. I will advertise your fucking car and tell you exactly what I think about it. If you're willing. If you're willing, I'm going to tell the God's honest truth. <laughs> That's funny. I'm going to tell you the God's honest truth, motherfuckers. So you want to take that chance and you want to put your money where your mouth is. Send me that Tesla SUV with the door that opens really cool. I, I made the guy stop and pull over and show me how the door works. And I got to see inside. And that fucking thing looks bad as fuck. Although the first time I saw an electric car, I got scared shitless. Lady came down the platform where I work. I turned around. There was a car. I almost jumped through the fucking building. <laughs> I said, how the fuck did you get in here? Push it. She said, it's electric. I said, get the fuck out of here. I know what an electric car looks like. It looks like some kind of little spaceship. They piece of shit. I want, I, want to try and pick, oh, I want to try to pick up one of them smart cars. Hey, smart car. You want an advertisement? I just want to, I'm afraid I'll bend it if I ever tried to. And then they'll think I'm trying to break in or something. But if you just want an advertisement, I want to see if I can pick up one of your cars. I also wanted to do a funny joke with me and three other fat guys going to the beach and having somebody else film it and the reactions. <laughs> and then the only thing I could think of is we'd get stuck in the car and they'd have to take us out with the jaws of life. I said, no, fuck you. That's too much. <laughs> And I was gonna, my buddy Woody would die laughing. That's my buddy. Dave's his dad. <laughs> my friend Ted, Ted, he wouldn't think it's funny. And Bill's a liberal. Oh, I argue with him, but he'll argue back. And we talk to him. He just says, ah, you're full of shit. You're full of shit. I'm like, I'm telling you, dude, go follow this and follow that. He won't listen. But he's a park ranger. What do you fucking expect? You think they would have voted Trump? Park Rangers like a cop to me. I give them the same goddamn respect. They tell me to get off the grass. I get the fuck off the grass. When he ain't looking, I get back on the grass. The fuck, that's how you live your life. We cheat a little, little white lies. Nothing wrong with that. Don't hurt nobody. Right? Put your heroin and your fucking cocaine. The mushrooms I never tried. I can't tell you shit about these mushrooms. I did do LSD and that shit didn't do shit for me. It made me want to drink. Cost me a fortune. My buddies were tripping. I took four hits. I didn't know what you were fucking supposed to do. I took one. Nothing happened after an hour. I took another one. Waited an hour. I'm drinking. Fucking another hour. Took another one. In the four. I drank two cases of fucking beer. Probably why I look like I do now. I'm going figure. <laughs> I'm tripping, I'm tripping. No, you weren't. Shut up. You were making shit. Well, maybe they were. I don't know. Didn't affect me none. I'm glad, though. Someone was looking out for me. I probably should have died. I don't know. I don't know what the fuck's in that little acid shit, but stay away from it. It ain't good from what I watched my friends. I didn't get fucked up. They did. But I didn't like the way they looked. Heroin? You ever see those people? And I'm not saying the rest of them all, but, you know... My fa I told the story about my father-in-law, the fucking judges. The poor guy asked him, hey, keep my son a month so he can clean up, and then we can work with him. The judge says, no, he's not that bad of a criminal. My father-in-law says, we've sent him everywhere. He's been in all these clinics. He's been in the hospitals. But if we had those state hospitals, that's where the prick could have went, cleaned his act up. He pissed me off because the first thing he did when he got out of jail was start smoking cigarettes. I said, hey, you stupid fuck, you should have beat the caffeine too by now. Why are you going to pick up something that costs that much money? 
Are you a fucking idiot? Stop. Put that down. That's how you save money, you stupid bastard. You're cleared to have it. You kicked it. You were forced to, but you kicked it. What's he do? He kept the same thing. And then he fell back into shit because he didn't listen to Thomas Sowell. I didn't know him preaching him. I've always preached Thomas Sowell. I guess I did remember his book after all. I didn't read the whole thing. I got to go back to it. It'll probably take me about eight minutes. <laughs> I screenshotted something and then I couldn't find it. It was 48 fucking pages and I went zing and I knew what the hell it said. <laughs> I hope this lasts forever. I have no idea. But we got to agree to how I'm and I can't post it. I'm going back to Bryson Gray. Bam, bam, bam.